Alright, it's Hake here, and I'm going to show you a software called Ravel Uninstaller, which will allow you to remove any program off your computer. Not only that, remove any registry keys and any kind of traces left behind. Now, normally people would use the uninstall feature in Windows if you went into your control panel, uninstall a program. So if you were to do it this way, say you want to uninstall anything, what will happen is it will want to install a program, but it will leave traces behind with your registry and uh, like registry traces, and it will also leave behind other tr parts of the software that don't get completely uninstalled. When you're using the add and remove program feature with Ravel on installer, this will actually completely remove the program along with any kind of registry trace and any kind of traces like files that normally don't get in uninstalled by default. So, uh, you can get this Ravel uninstaller off the uh, website. Uh, they're offering a 28-day working trial. I think it's a 30-day trial of the uh, software. I think it's like $30 for the full version. But if I were to click on... The way this uh, software works is if I were to click on anything that I have installed on my computer when I open it up. So this is basically a list of all the software that I have on the computer. So for an example, if I wanted to remove this live chat uh, client. If I open that up, what it will do is it will create a system restore point and it will create a registry backup real fast and then it will prompt me to uninstall the program like it would in add and remove program. So next, I'll go remove, remove, and that's that. That's uninstalled. Alright, now with Ravel uninstaller, we have what's called this advance option. So if you check this advance option and click scan, it will scan for additional traces to that program and registry keys. So give it a moment. So here we have all the additional registry traces for this program. So what you want to do is you want to click select all and click delete. That will delete any kind of traces left behind that was not already uninstalled. Click yes. And then it's going to say found leftover Files and folders. Again, click select all. Delete. And that will delete any more traces that are left behind. So, same thing for image burn. It's the exact same thing. It will go ahead. It will create a system restore point up. Uninstall. And as you can see, you can uninstall programs real fast with this program. That's why I like it. And again, make sure you check advanced options. Scan for additional registry keys. Again, select all these registry entry, uh, entries because these are just left beh behind traces. Click delete. Are you sure you want to delete? And then, then the, there you go. You've got rid of all the traces as well. And now it's completely removed from the system. So if you liked uh, this kind of video, remember to comment, rate, and subscribe.